All right, it's Wednesday. Um, feeling good from the Panama City uh, race and did do CrossFit Monday and Tuesday, knowing that I'm going on a longer trip from today, Wednesday night to Sunday. I'm gonna be in France for work. Um, I'm gonna do, before this flight, I'm gonna do a new FTP test. My old FTP was 229, max heart rate 193, and I'm gonna do it again. And we're gonna do the same test, ramp test, 43 minute. Um, why does it do that? All right, 40 minute ramp test. Let's do it. I'm starting to get nervous. Swift has all these prompts like, make sure you give it everything you've got. It's based on your best one minute all out. Every stroke counts. I'm pretty sure I was shot like halfway through last time. But I've got two minutes of warm up to go. And then we begin. I'm not gonna take much footage until we're done. Um, really curious if this is gonna, if I'm gonna improve or not. I mean, it's three days after this race, but my legs feel okay. So yeah, here we go, one and a half minutes to go. Just finished. FTP went up to 242. Was pretty much useless after the 300 watt intervals but progress that's it going on this trip uh, i'm happy today's my first day back uh, at training and uh, i wasn't gonna vlog today i just finished my swim it was a recovery swim just like 2,000 meters woke up this morning i did not feel like training at all i was even debating skipping today but something just happened that was worth vlogging so I just finished my swim and um, this lady was waiting for me and I could tell her accent was from France. So when I got out, I'm like, where are you from? She says, I'm from France. And I said, I was just there yesterday. I just flew in from Marseille. And she goes, she was like being sarcastic. You're, you're in the pool already after yesterday traveling from France? And I'm like, that's fucking right I am. Boom. Yeah, so Sunday I got back from France. Monday, right back into swimming and CrossFit. I uh, still did a recovery swim on Monday, even though I was kind of recovered, but it was it was hard to get back into things. Uh, CrossFit's rough right now. It's so hot in the gym. Like, 10 minutes into these workouts, I'm just, like, done. But I'm, I'm drinking that element every morning, and I might even need a second one at night. So uh, I might, might start that up today. <sighs> Yesterday, I did my bike. Had a really good bike session. Didn't run, though. Um, did an hour and 30 and PR'd a couple climbs and uh, just sore, just really sore and tired from it. Um, CrossFit, we had front squats, uh, lots of reps and heavy. I was able to do four of the five rounds, so I was happy about that. I think it was like 165, so I did 40 reps for 165. Um, today, I, I had to settle for the 25 yard uh, pool. Usually I get the 50 meter pool. All that means is I got to turn around double in the 25 yard one for 3,000 meters or 3,000 yards. I got the distance done, but towards the end, my calves, both of them uh, cramped up and I looked down and my calf was like in my body. It was disgusting. So that's a bit concerning. That happened to me during a race once, uh, two or three years ago in Ironman Arizona, like towards the end of the swim but this was bad this was like really bad the short pool at at pompano beach um aquatic center is hot as f it's it's like piss warm and the 50 meter one is is chilled so it's it's much more comfortable i feel like the temperature of the pool has something to do with the uh with the cramping that wraps up wednesday let's go panthers game one panthers rangers Saturday. Um, I'm really tired. I gotta do a four or five hour bike ride. <sighs> Two peanut butter and jellies. <sighs> I 
Vest is meeting me for this ride. I've got a session set up with Mike. Um, I'm gonna do Quatch Quest. So it's like 5,000 something elevation gain. It's gonna suck, but it'll be good when it's over. Um, one amazing thing that's gonna happen today is I am gonna finally earn the Tron bike. Uh, for those that don't know, when you do like the elevation of Everest, there's this Everest challenge within Zwift, and if you uh, if you hit that elevation gain, then you earn a new bike. And in this case, it's a Tron bike. And after that, I don't have to I don't have to fucking do elevation tests anymore in the in the Zwift. Okay, and I got three minutes to go. That's is gonna be late. I could already tell. There it is, 84% complete. 24,000 of 29,000. I will get it. Today's the day. Oh, I can't wait. It's gonna be good. Alright, five hours later. Hopefully I can do this in four hours. I hope. Let's see. As usual, I'm on time. I'm here. Mike is not. It's just the way it is. I'm trying something new today. Long socks. Got these big fucking calves. Let me see if this helps me out. Helps my calves feel better. It's like a little it's like a little calf hug. Doing the elevation that we're doing in fifty-five miles. Okay? Yeah. So, this is harder. Just fucking get it done. All right. All right, when you're done at the top, call me. I'll call you when I'm at the top. Yeah, it's horrible, it's horrible. Yeah, but eat it so yeah. better, it's easier. All right, man, good luck. All right, see you at the top. Bye. Bye. 50 mile an hour, but I can't get past 48. Dude, I am in, I am in pain. I know, but dude, the unit's gonna feel great when you get to the top. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, there you come. <laughs> I'm gonna see you. There we go, 50! <laughs> Push hard. Uh, 52. Oh, <laughs> here you go. Holy shit. <laughs> oh. Do it. Do it. Just finished. <clears throat> I'm dying. Just finished Quatch, finished Quatch Quest on Zwift. 5,500 feet of elevation gain, 30 miles. It took me like four hours and 40 minutes. I tried to do 430, just couldn't do it. I didn't PR anything. Um, I, I went into this sick and tired. Last night the Panthers lost to the Rangers in overtime, so that pissed me off. And uh, just uh, did not feel like doing the workout. Thank God Mike showed up like 10 15 minutes late because he flew by me on the bike and uh, finished before me and motivated me to finish myself so thank god because I, I i probably would have quit one or two hours into this workout and and that probably um i would have i would have been like depressed all day not finishing the workout so it got done I, i'm not gonna run i'm just not feeling it i'm sick and i need to rest I'm gonna run tomorrow. <clears throat> Murph on Monday. Um, let's see how that goes. Oh, time to eat and rest. That's the rest of the day. Yep. We've got the Murph today. One mile run. 
100 pull-ups, 200 push-ups, 300 squats, one mile run. Last year it took me 58 minutes and my goal was to go sub one hour, which I did. Um, the pull-ups, I had to do jumping pull-ups on a 45 and 25 pound plate. And push-ups, I did real push-ups. And uh, squats, I did real squats. Uh, I split them up Cindy style, which was five reps, 10 reps, 15 reps for the, for the whole thing. I did 20 sets. I'm going to do the same thing, but now jumping off of just only a 45 pound plate, make it a little bit harder this year and just try to beat my time. So let's see. I had three days, three or four days in Cartagena with the guys. Uh, forgot to take footage the entire time. I left my camera in my bag and just always kept forgetting to take it. But uh, before we leave, <laughs> Mauricio's laughing because I'm finally getting footage. Mauricio, I'm getting footage. Yeah, you're Alright, we are going on the Guatape tour. It's day two in Medellin. The guys are hungover. Mauricio's blacked out. Alex is fine. Jason's blacked out. Wilson's fine. Petit's blacked out. <laughs> Check out this bowl. They just put chlorine in it. We're at Guatape in Colombia. It's this big fucking rock that we're about to climb and put on Strava. Oh, cool. Emily, I'm going to put on for two minutes yeah I can't breathe push <laughs> what is it? Like little. Oh, nice. No, no, gracias. Gracias. Now we're having lunch. We thought Wilson died. <laughs> Thank God he's okay. He scared the shit out of me. I almost started crying. The menu. How you feeling, Petit? Good. Feel pretty good. Wilson? Good. All good. All good. Maurice, how you feeling? Awesome. Alex? Alright, go. How you feeling? I need a medic. 
bunch of bunch of pussies. Bunch of I would never say this to them, but bunch of bunch of pussies. This is the Airbnb. Beautiful. The house. Driveway. Freaking soccer field. We have to make a game out of this. A okay. game. Are you okay? I was afraid to hit my nutsack. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you fucking go for it. He's almost knocked me out. So we're about to do a circuit. We're in front of the Airbnb. And we've got this massive hill right in front of the Airbnb and we were thinking we'll do hill sprints with a 10, 10, uh, 10 push ups and then a one minute plank. Do as many rounds as possible with the time we have. So here we go. I was not expecting you 